This is Scott from KIG. It's Friday, Friday, April 26th, and this is our carrier Aquasnap chiller. Uh, this is our 45-ton unit, model 30 RAN 045-611KA, serial number 0404F13610, which means it's a two, uh, 2004 unit. Uh, 460 volt. We're gonna turn this on in a second and do uh, one of several videos to show it show it cooling down. Um, in the back of our chiller over here is uh, our test bed. Basically this is a about a 300 gallon tank or so and we have an electric heater um, mold temperature control heater to heat the water. Right now we have it up to about uh, 86 degrees Fahrenheit, a little bit more. Um, and for this test or demo, we're just going to chill it down to 40. Um, obviously, we're not creating a 45 ton load with this, uh, but we're able to uh, demonstrate that the chiller, chiller runs well and test it out and so forth. These are our pumps here on our little test bed. Uh, we're actually using uh, two pumps. Um, each about one and a half horsepower. Uh, to create the flow. And it is currently running uh, and connected to the back of our unit here. So I'm just going to go around to the front. And turn our unit on to enable here. Now usually when you turn uh, turn the chillers on, there's a, uh, a little bit of a delay, um, just as a safety. I'm going to go right to the set points and just show you that we have cooling set point one set to 40 degrees Fahrenheit, and so we're going to chill down to 40 degrees F. On a chiller this big, it'll happen pretty quickly. Most likely with the load, we're only going to run one compressor at a time. We have tested each compressor and uh, the whole chiller extensively. Uh, while that's going through its delay, um, this here are the MotorMaster variable speed drives. That is what controls the fan speed based on pressure. Uh, and it also allows this unit to be put outside if desired for future use um, and gives it the capability of operating in lower ambient conditions outside. This here is one of four compressors. This is the brand new compressor that we installed right here. And we put in a new dryer also in the second. And the chiller just turned on. So while we're starting up, we'll take a peek in here too. This just shows you the plumbing and our, uh, our sight glasses, which always look green. Here are other compressors too. So right now we'll go to uh, our view mode. Run status, view. Entering water temperature. So right now we're at. Oh, it's gonna go right through. We'll just leave it at LWT, which is leaving water temperature. So right now we got some warm fluid running through at 83, and we can see that it's starting to chill already. Uh, and we'll come back in a, in, a, in a bit of time and show you as we approach the 40 degree set point.